Oh, I don't really care how we look, to be fair. Um, <laughs> bit of a witch. Um, it's it's still been less than a year, um, but uh, I'm on my own. John's at work. Uh, Lucy's going on her way to my Ned to Butlins, and Katie's away in Brighton. <laughs> Uh, so I'm on my own um, and I just sort of got thinking like every time I go up the stairs of Richie's I could just feel when I'm walking across the carpet that he was there um, it reminds me of what I saw how I felt so you can see it still Still a bit of a struggle. Uh, you just think you you cope with it, but it's half term and I've not had any work, so I've had time to think. And uh, when I think it gets a bit dangerous. I smoke now, which ironically killed my mum. Um, I started smoking because I was hoping she would come back and tell me off. That I would see her. Um, that her soul would be strong enough to come back and let me know. But it never happened and then I've got addicted as what happened I don't smoke a lot uh, but it's my like little bit of escape I don't want to wave a cigarette in front of the camera because I am slightly embarrassed um, but when I'm on my own it it gets me thinking about the people that I've lost the loved ones they aren't people, they're loved ones that I've lost in my life, in my family um, and it just you know, it just reminds you when you've got no time to, to feel it just reminds you and then I've got the teary eyes and the snotty nose and so it time they say time heals. No, it doesn't. Time gets you used to the fact that they're not around. Uh, you forever be sad. You'll forever miss them. And forever want to see them. Just one more time. Just to make sure that they're okay, but I haven't had that, what they call a visit, I haven't had that visit, I haven't had that one more time, and whether I feel sad because the girls aren't here and they don't, they help to take my mind off it, or whether it's just like an amalgamation of everything over the last sort of few months where I'm awaiting therapy and stuff. And it hasn't happened yet. Even though I self-harm, or I have done, I, I feel quite proud of myself to say I haven't done it for quite a while. Because I know how I let my family down. And I don't want to do that. So that sort of stops me. The, um, um, the strength of love that I have for my family stops stops me from doing it. Uh, but uh, I was helping carry out today, bro. Just helping out with Malachi and sorting stuff out there. And I just kept imagining you being on that phone speaking to the people 
to say this is my boy, this is what he's like, we need help. But you weren't there and you'll never be there, which is hard. It's really hard. But life has to go on. I have to move forward every day and try every day. But guys, it doesn't it doesn't magically disappear. And what what really frustrates me and what, what really gets to me is is all these celebrities that lose people and then two weeks, three weeks later they're, you know, it's like, you know, plastered in makeup and, and, and they're fine. I don't put makeup on to hide my puffy eyes. I plaster a smile on. But I don't plaster makeup on just to, to make me look any different, to, you know, to make me feel like everything's okay and I'm beautiful. If I put makeup on, it's because it's a special occasion or, uh, like, tonight I'm going out with my husband, so I might put a little bit of makeup on then. But once my puffy eyes go down, But I miss you, bro, and I miss mum, <laughs> and dad and Angie. And I still don't think it's fair. I don't know what we've done. <laughs> we haven't done anything. In fact, we've been the subject of more than what we deserve in a negative way. <laughs> so we need to deserve what we deserve. A break from from debt, which we're in, from 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 life. It just sometimes it just makes me want to be there with you guys, and that's not good. That's not good for my girls because then they're gonna go without me being there. I mean, look, I don't do Botox. Look at my front lines. Look. I don't do lip fillers. I don't do makeup, obviously. Brown eyes. I just live every day the best I can. But I just want to tell you, Rich, you're not forgotten. Mum, you're not forgotten. Dad, you're not forgotten. Angie, you're not forgotten. Every day. <sighs> And it is, as I've just heard a Westlife song, Until I See You Again. I love you all so very much. And that's why it hurts so much. God bless.